After 89 dry days at McCarran, we have finally broken the streak, the fourth longest in Las Vegas's recorded history. Yesterday, a trace. Today, don't have those uh, rain totals out just yet, but I'm hoping for a little more than a trace. Want to get you a check outside. Love to see this. A stormy view from Stratcam as storms develop over the Sheep Range and the Spring Mountains this afternoon and evening. And of course, satellite and radar reflecting the same view. As we zoom in on the desert Doppler, a dying thunderstorm over Mountain Pass. This is just south and west of Prim, a little further north. You can see the Sheep Range and the Spring Mountains still have a little bit of that thunderstorm activity. But I want to point out uh, this is where working from home is tough. I want to be able to point to what I'm talking about. But you can see a line of green kind of moving into the Centennial Hills area over the 95. That's actually an outflow boundary. That is not rain. That is the gusty wind coming out of those thunderstorms over the Spring Mountains. And that is why we are looking at this fire danger. Red flag warning in place across the region because of the gusty winds thanks to these uh, outflow boundaries as well as the lightning associated with the thunderstorms. That was an issue earlier today on this, the Spring Mountains. I believe we have a fire currently burning there because of the dry lightning and then you couple that with the gusty winds thanks to these thunderstorms and that does elevate the fire danger. We will continue to see the thunderstorm activity off and on through this evening. Future cast showing conditions quieting down a little bit overnight into tomorrow but a few isolated thunderstorms possible tomorrow morning as well and then tomorrow afternoon, we do expect another round similar to what we saw today with those scattered thunderstorms, pockets of heavy rain and gusty winds. So the monsoon moisture is here and it looks like it's bringing us a few days with storm chances. Something important to uh, to remember considering how long we went without any rain. It kind of hit us all at once and we will see those several days in a row with storm chances. Right now, 107 in Las Vegas, Anthem, North Las Vegas, 104 in Boulder City. We do expect the heat to continue at least through tomorrow, but we we do back off a bit heading into the second half of the work week. Triple digits through dinner time tonight with temperatures tomorrow topping out near 107. That is still a touch above average with mostly sunny skies. But again, those uh, monsoon storms could pop up with that 10 to 20 percent storm chance. We're going to keep the storm chances in play because you see the moisture. It, it really lingers throughout the week, even though dew points are just marginal in the 40s. Uh, today, it definitely supplied enough uh, energy in the atmosphere to see some of those storms pop up. So isolated thunderstorms this evening, scattered thunderstorms possible tomorrow. We'll get a brief break on Wednesday, but by Wednesday night into Thursday, another push of moisture moving in, bumping up those storm chances. Right now, it looks like we'll dry, dry out this weekend. Temperatures uh, will back off below average again by Thursday. Ross? I feel so bummed out. I missed the rain this morning. I must not have fallen in my neighborhood.